James Carter TV here to recap yet another Tennessee Titans debacle and I tried to tell you people I tried to stand here and tell you people that the Tennessee Titans were nothing but inept that they were a terrible football team and that they were going to come out at home in Nashville come out and play terrible and lose yet another football game I didn't care who was starting at quarterback and I don't care who's starting a quarterback for the next eight weeks. This team will finish 4-12, and 12, and that is just the end of this discussion. Uh, I mean, today they were awful. I mean, they were absolutely dreadful in each and every phase of the game. The defense played well in this first half and then fell apart in the second half. And having a terrible offense will do that to you. The offense looked like it was a college, hell, high school football team. It was absolutely terrible. Oh my goodness, how bad this football team is. And it's time to rebuild. I mean, that's just what it is. I mean, there are trade rumors that we want to trade Michael Griffin and I say good. I mean, just I just want it to be burned down. There is something genetically wrong with this team, and it needs to get out of here. Okay, there is some cancer, some issue, some tumor that is preventing the Titans from being a decent football team at this juncture. And whatever it is needs to be eliminated. Eliminated immediately and uh, heads should roll heads won't roll but they should I'm sure Tommy Smith, Tommy Smith will tell him something hey, it's okay we'll put it off to next season we'll see how we do next season but the fact of the matter is this there's something needs to change on this football team and I'm hoping that one of these electric quarterbacks whether it be Jameis Winston or Marcus Mariota can bring a new look a new feel a new excitement to this team because right now these players don't want to play they don't want to play these football games I, I mean they just they they don't the offensive line is not interested in playing football I mean they are absolutely terrible penalties out the wazoo uh, and I understand I mean I mean you, you, you're going through this bad season yet again 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 I mean let's look at their records since 2009 you have 8 and 8 in 2009 you have 6 and 10 in 2010 you have 9 and 7 in 2011 you have six and ten in 2012. You have seven and nine in 2013, and now you're going to be four and 12. You're going to be four and 12 this 2014 regular season, and it sucks and it stinks and it's terrible. But you got to get over it. Uh, so this team is, is terrible. It is absolutely terrible. Tear it down. Do whatever you have to do. Zach Medberg, eh, he was okay, but enough. Enough. Okay. Well, no, we need a superstar. I mean, that's just it, and that is has nothing to do with Zach Medberger. He played okay. If he was playing for the Tampa Bay Buccaneers, good. We here, us in Tennessee, here right now, we need a superstar, a player who can transcend a team. Look at Robert Griffin, transcended his team, albeit for one year. Look at Andrew Luck, transcended his team. We need a quarterback, to me, a quarterback who can come in and transcend this team, a superstar. That is what this team has desperately needed since 2010. And we, hell, until 2009 too. Since 2009, since we've missed the playoffs. We need a superstar. And it's time to get one of the 2015 NFL Draft. And we're only halfway through the season. But we already know this. So go get you one. Because right now we don't have one. And without one, you're not going to do anything in this league. Until next time, James Carter TV. I'm out. Peace.